How to direct kids on a film set in six steps. Number one, have a stunt double ready. Because filming usually takes so long and there's a lot of pressure for those kids, it really makes them exhausted. Therefore, if you have some shots where you don't see their front face, also if you have some shots that only require the hands as a close-up or a very wide shot, you could totally leave that to a double to do. This will increase the entire efficiency. Two, having some reference videos prepared. Especially little animation clips will help. If you have certain mood expressions or movements that you want the kid to do but it's a bit hard to execute, you can let them watch these reference videos and try to imitate. This will make it easier. 3. Try to find out what the kid likes the most. In this case, for example, this one really likes chips. Therefore, if we finished a difficult take, we would give her some chips. So she feels very motivated to do the next one. And you need to have that prepared beforehand. But also you would have to communicate that with the parents and also have it in a proper amount because you don't want to exaggerate this. Four, try to limit the overall amount of crew member in a room. And of course, if the filming and script allows that. This can make sure that the kid is more confident and can open up fully while acting. 5. Using visual languages to tell the story. So for example, there might be some movements that the kid couldn't do or there's a difficult process to get him or her from point A to point B. Then try to use a different way to tell the story. So for example, you can cut to a point of view perspective of the kid to finish that transition. 6. Sometimes it's really difficult to do the line of sight directing of kids. They often just look around and never have a point of focus in their eyes. And sometimes if it's too difficult to get, you could also try the last trick, which is put your camera settings into slow motion mode. Crank up the frame rate and try to catch those precious acting moments. And that's it, there are also some additional tricks in the post-production. Let's talk about it in the comments section. If you like Bell and see more awesome content like this. See you next one, 再见!